Welcome to 2023 Innovative Cars YouTube channel. Before starting this if you like this video ring that bell and subscribe to my channel for future updates. The Mercedes-Benz SL is one of the most iconic cars to ever come from Stuttgart since 1954, way before AMG was even a thing. The SL is Mercedes's longest-running nameplate. Across 70 years of production, the Mercedes-Benz SL radiates a sporty, elegant roadster ride built with the same formula since 1954, a lightweight two-door coupe backed by a potent engine, simple stuff, but that is changing with the 2023 SL43 AMG. Aside from their iconic SL55 and SL63, AMG brings two plus two-seater excitement and a powerful electric turbocharged powertrain. With electrification and global demand diminishing engine size, Mercedes AMG is now offering their SL with a four-cylinder engine. The super light AMG SL43 gets a 2.0-liter turbocharged engine making 381 horsepower and 352 feet-pound of torque. New turbocharging technology by Mercedes-AMG is borrowed from the Petronas F1 car, combining an electric exhaust gas turbocharger for the first time in a production vehicle. Throughout its timeline, the SL has consistently set innovative milestones. The iconic 300 SL Gullwing was the world's first production car with direct fuel injection in 1954. The new Mercedes-AMG SL43 is the first production car with an electric exhaust gas turbocharger. The 2023 SL43 AMG carries the M139 turbocharged four-cylinder found in the Gla 45 and Gla 45 producing 381 horsepower and 353 pounds-foot of torque. For the first time, Mercedes-AMG is mounting their M139 engine longitudinally and pairing it with the AMG Speedshift MCT9G transmission. The SL43 AMG will do 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.9 seconds and reach a top speed of 170 miles per hour. How the SL43 AMG makes its power is the most interesting and innovative part. Mercedes AMG engines have been all about turbo power in the past few years. With turbo comes turbo lag, which for those of you that don't know, is the gap in time it takes the turbo to kick and the driver to feel the acceleration. Turbo lag can last as much as one second, which doesn't sound much on paper, except that it makes a difference on track. Turbo lag occurs because it takes time for the engine to create enough exhaust pressure to spin the turbo and pump compressed intake air into the engine. Mercedes AMG released an electric turbocharger back in 2020 to be first used on their Formula One engines. The idea behind an electric turbocharger is designed to combine the advantages of a compact turbocharger with fast response times and relatively low peak performance and a large turbocharger with high peak performance but delayed responses. An electric motor sits between the turbine wheel on the exhaust side and the compressor wheel on the intake side. This motor is electronically controlled to match the speed of the compressor wheel and turbine wheel before exhaust pressure starts to spin conventionally, thus reducing turbo lag and making for a more responsive turbo four-cylinder. This turbo technology, assisted by a 48-volt starter generator can generate 14 additional ponies for short periods of time. In addition to temporary extra horses, the starter generator integration also brings hybrid functions like gliding mode and energy recovery for maximum efficiency. The redesigned SL brings S-Class amenities, a redefined 2 plus 2 seater with all the luxury features possibly found on any convertible. Speaking of which, the cloth top can be operated with speeds up to 37 miles per hour, transforming the SL from a hot convertible to an exotic roadster in a full 15 seconds. The longest running nameplate by Mercedes shaped the SL into a very desirable roadster. To start with, the 2022 SL is longer in wheelbase, hence making space for two additional tiny rear seats, similar to the 1989 SL four-seater. This makes the new SL even more versatile. The super light, however, is the center of focus for Mercedes-AMG. The new SL43 is built using a material mix that makes it more rigid at low weight. The windscreen, for instance, is made out of a mix of aluminum, magnesium, fiber composites and steel. The chassis is made of lightweight aluminum composite and consists of an aluminum space frame with a self-supporting structure. The hardtop is no longer available with the 2022 SL, it only comes with a cloth top, reducing weight and lowering the center of gravity. These measures allow for an 18% increase in torsional rigidity over the previous SL, as well as a 50% increase in transverse rigidity and a 40% increase in longitudinal rigidity over the AMG GT Roadster. 
the enhanced overall stiffness provides a superior foundation for more precise handling and agility. What do you think about this video? Do let us know down in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from us again be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go.